welcome back to my channel. If this is your first time here, my name is Tess. And if you are a returning returning viewer, thank you so much. I appreciate you, your support. Um, I'm not always consistent and I did do a name change. And um, so those of you who have put the extra effort out and come watch my channel and resubscribe if you needed to, I appreciate it. So thank you so much. All right, in today's video, I am going to a cash stuff my five, ten, and twenty dollar binders. So let's go ahead and get started. So the reason I have Disneyland here was my granddaughter, when she was almost a year old, her mom and dad had decided they wanted to take her to Disneyland because they they love Disneyland. They'd already gone once, and they wanted to take her to Disneyland um, for her fifth birthday. And they want everyone to go in the family. So they let everybody know. Few, you know, the few family we have on our side, few and far between, but everyone got the heads up. You got, you know, four more years or to, or to almost five years to plan for it if you want to go. So I made up these, um, you call it, these little trackers. Let me take this one out. And I saved last year. I wasn't real consistent with it. It wasn't my top priority, but I did manage to save six hundred dollars. So. I made the little, isn't that cute? I actually made a couple designs, made my daughter something more that she would like. This is, I love little castles in pink, so this was more for me. And it's Disneyland with Denali is what we're calling it. And on the back I did $5 trackers, because you know, I don't know, sometimes you want to just put a few bucks in. And then I had some big ones, and when it's done, it adds up to $1,000. And um, so yeah. That is what I did. So I saved last year, but I got 600. So I didn't get the full thousand, which is fine. It's absolutely fine. I'll have more than enough if I keep this pace up. And if I don't, it, it just helps with the cost when the time comes. So anyway, $600 for last year. And then this is one for this year, and it has nothing in it. We're gonna stuff it today. I, what I'm gonna be, what I'm gonna do is uh, my $5 binder at the end of the year. It's uh, 120. Um, a month so at the end of the year that would be twelve hundred dollars so I should be able to get my thousand in this year so that is something I'm going to start new this year and then I made one for the following two years so it starts in September on her birthday and it ends the, on her birthday when she's five so I made four of them up thank goodness I printed them up because they're gone all of it the whole the whole file's gone can't find it um, I don't know you know sometimes I I like things cleared out I might have deleted it I don't know but it's gone so because it's September and the end of it she just had her birthday her second birthday it's time to work on her second challenge here so that we're going to work on today so let's just get started with the the five dollar binder so the money in here is going to go in there so before I get started Ella's here to say hello we're going to go ahead and step this five dollar binder and so last, um, last month was for last year. It's $120 for August. It starts in September. There's $120. And that was put into, that's part of that $600. Now we're starting a new year on, on Disneyland. And it's right here. It's okay. So September. So let's, so we need to do, finish up September here. We need one, two, three, four, five, six of them. I've got five, 10, 15, 20, 25. There's five. And then the sixth one, I found, I got a star note a couple weeks ago, so, or a week ago. So yeah, I'll put a star note in there. So this should add up to 120. Five, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95, 100, 5, 10, 15, 20, 120. Let me color this up real quick. Okay, and September is done, and we'll start on October on my next video. So yeah, just this alone will give us more than what I need for my tracker, so there's September. 120 bucks done and we will yay so I will I'll cash that out put it into the Disneyland envelope 
And then I just put full money to keep a little tracker in there. Placement. Okay, so there's that one. Okay, let's start with the $10 binder. So the $10 binder, the goal of that one is, and it's, this, this one isn't necessarily set in stone, but my goal is here just to add it to my $20 binder when I help fill that up faster. Okay, let's do this. So I need four, 10, 20, 30, 40, there's four. I should have 160, I believe. 20, 40, 20, woo, that'd be nice. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 1, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 160. And let me color that in. So this money will be, this money here will be um, put into transfer, I mean, put it into, I'll cash them in for $20 bills and I'm gonna stick that in my binder next time. Or if I do it before, then I will do it for then. So we will start on October next. Okay. There we go. Caught up on those. And then this last one. I already put, let's see where we're at here. I already put some in there from before. So we're at one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight hundred dollars in there right now. So we're gonna got a few more twenties here. I'm starting at thirty-eight. Okay, and I'll do this one first. And I also got a twenty-dollar star note. So I'm gonna put that away real quick. I don't know what I'm gonna do with them. I mean, I'm not a big collector, but it's kind of fun to have something a little different. So this is 97. Um, but you know, when I unstuff it, I'll either, last time, I'll, I've already filled this up once, and I am, um, gosh, I'm so bad about doing my shout outs. That's the reason I even do this. Okay, so there's that. So we have 97. Okay, so let me start with this. I created this book, one for my daughter, she got a bigger one, and I made me a small one, and I've used it to stuff $20 bills. I will still say, this is my favorite way. For some reason, it just seems easier. You see the progress, instead of spread out more, not necessary for everyone, but I, for me, I'm really enjoying this binder. So I think, um, I'm not filling up as fast because I'm spreading it out, but it's just, it's, it just seems so much easier to get a $20 bill here and there, here and there. So um, I created this and I get a lot of compliments on it. Oh, I'm not ready to put this away yet. So I don't get a lot of compliments and the comments are on this. They love this binder. It's Audrey Hepburn from Breakfast at Tiffany's. Nothing is impossible. The world word itself says impossible. This has my daughter's name. Holly Golightly is the character. It's also my daughter's name, and I wanted to wanted to match hers. And I did an under hundred envelope challenge. So, since it seems to be a favorite, what I'm going to do is, I think I might make one for a um, a thank you gift. So, if you think you would like one and like me to make you one as a thank you gift, leave a pastry in the comments and that's going to tell me that you're interested in one if I make one all right I probably will but if I would say if if I make one don't know what will happen but if I make another one because I have to order this then I'm to see if I can still get this if not there's other ones I still have to order a binder but I'm happy to make one as a thank you gift that way it lets me know that you are you're interested you do have to be 18 years or older that's a um, YouTube rule um, so, and I do all my interactions and all my giveaways through Etsy. So it'll be posted on here, but to contact me and give me your information and to verify it's you, etc., it's done through Instagram. So if you don't have Instagram, then, then this isn't gonna work for you um, because I don't give out my email to people and um, it's too easy to have links put on there and me just click on it or Etsy. I, I mean, Instagram is just much easier and less, um, yeah, less chance of me getting a virus on my computer. So. 
Um, again, if you would like one uh, as a thank you gift for, for watching and subscribing, um, then yeah, put a, put a pastry in the comments and I will add it to you. And, um, you know, I'll, I will, you know, be a few videos before I probably get to it because I have to order stuff, but we'll just see. Let's see what kind of interest there is. Okay, let me do this now. So now I have some 20s here. I have one, two, three, and four. That's $100. So this should be 38, 39, 40, 41. Yeah, there we go. So 40 to 41. Now when this is full, 100 envelopes gives you $2,000. So like I said, this is my second time this year doing it. And I don't know if I'll finish it. I don't have, I don't know, I have it arranged. I'm just putting it, you know, doing it when I can. And so I did this one. Last time I think I put this, so yeah, I put this in my 100 envelope, 100 envelope regular challenge, the 5,000, not all of it, I put some of that in there and helped get that filled up a little faster. So that was fun. I did an unveiling on that. You can see it in the past video. So, but yeah, I love this binder. Um, I love just the $20, 100 envelope challenge. It just works. Five and 10, I'm not quite finding it not necessarily that helpful. The $5 now that I have a bigger purpose for it, but, um, but I'm going to keep doing what I'm doing. So, and this money will either go into savings or I'll just use it for something else. It's for whatever I want. And if my little baby, my bonus baby, my granddaughter, she's if she doesn't quit getting so darn cute, I might be able to save a few more bucks. <laughs> She's had her birthday, I had so much. I was wondering, we had so many presents for her, little big things, little things. Her favorite is the Elsa doll and the, the Olaf. Oh my gosh, she loves that thing. She just, she just kisses the Olaf. She chews on him. She just thinks he's the best thing ever. Alrighty, so 40 to 41. Okay, that actually cleared that off because I got four down here. So I've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I've got nine hundred dollars. I'm almost halfway done with this. Gosh, it doesn't seem like I that one twenty last time really helped. I think I put it all in there. I think I did. So anyway, yeah. If you want this, leave a croissant. And these are hundred envelope challenges. I have different color ones. It's in my freebie doc link. If you go to my main page at the top, you'll see a little Google Doc has a bunch of freebies in there that's these are in there so if you want this or if you win this and you want them i've got i think it has pink blue that might be only in lavender i think are the three colors i had because those are the three binders i made for people okay that is it isn't it it is oh wow let's see let's see nope i think that's it so thank you for spending this time with me i know you have options um i'm so appreciative that you chose to watch this channel if you made it to the end, put a birthday cake. That lets me know that you watched to the end. And, and there's a reason I do that. So we'll just leave it at that for now. And I, um, if you made this far, put a birthday cake. I hope you'll join me again. And remember, every dollar counts. Bye-bye.